I have kind of been accumulating oh, honeymoon clothes. <laughs> It has been a couple days since I last picked up the camera. I am heading now to get my nails done because they are super grown out from the wedding. It's definitely been a couple weeks and I was cleaning earlier. And I don't know if you guys ever have this happen with the dip powder, but like I kind of like ram my nail into the toaster, wiping it down like a surface and it, it just like cracked the nail and it was just like, oh, that's when like I know it's time to get them done, but they were able to squeeze me in to get my nails done today, which is good because we leave for our honeymoon in a couple days and I know they'll be closed on Sunday and we leave on Monday. I'm super excited because the last time I was here they had this really pretty, um, oh, this really pretty neon green. So let's go. All right, you guys, I am going to whip us up some dinner. Tonight we're having Hello Fresh and I'm making something new that we've never had before, so I'm pretty hyped. So we already had one of our dinners last night, but then we also have left these two meals and we've never had the firecracker meatballs. This looks bomb. So let's go ahead and uh, get to cooking. All right, so if you guys don't know about HelloFresh yet, I have been literally cooking their meals for years. They are America's number one meal kit. So they offer so many recipes to choose from each week and it really helps to break out of any recipe ruts. Great to try new things and new flavors and HelloFresh really cuts out stressful meal planning and prepping so you can actually enjoy cooking, get dinner on the table in just about 30 minutes or even 20 minutes with their quick and easy options. And HelloFresh has pre-portioned ingredients which means there's less prep for you and less wasted food. They give you just what you need. And if you guys want to, you can add extra dinners or lunches to your weekly order, throw in extra proteins, or add in yummy meal compliments like HelloFresh's best-selling garlic bread. And something that we love when we cook HelloFresh is knowing that they are committed to making fresh, delicious food available now more than ever, and they've taken extra steps to keep their employees and customers safe. So if you guys want to check out HelloFresh, there will be a link below. We could not recommend them more. It's so yummy. Go to HelloFresh.com. Use my code FEARLESS14 to get 14 free meals, including free shipping. Yara has the perfect bag for travel. And we finally get to use it for travel. It has all these pockets here. Yeah. All right, so it's easily accessible. Yeah. I have lots of room here. There's no compartments, you know, it's it's very open. <laughs> a nice little flap here. Nice, right. nice. And guess what? You ready for this? Pouch there. You can Velcro anything that I want there. I can attach anything to these straps here. You got mad right. pouches. I have a nice little easy compartment here for passport, whatever, right? Nice. IDs, vaccination cards, whatever you need, right? Nice. And guess what? And I have a nice little laptop. Wow. So, this backpack by Nike, it's very useful. Nice. Oh, it looks what's, so good. It smells amazing. What's the name amazing. of this dish? Um, they're called like firecracker meatballs. Firecracker meatballs. All right. I made them with like only a little sriracha because it required like a uh, whole thing of it. Okay, okay. So I like made it Yarman friendly. Mm, mm -hmm. <laughs> the flavor. Mm. Man, like 30 minutes? <laughs> or less. It was probably like 25. Super easy. Because they have everything going at the same time. So like it's just, it's, yeah, so, it's, like, it's so convenient. Like it's very efficient. Very efficient. Know? That's the right word. Thanks, HelloFresh. Love you guys. Wow. On with the vlog. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So mm. it is currently Saturday. We leave on Monday and got a lot to do. We got a lot to do these next two days. I did get my nails done last night. They're so fun. This neon yellowy green. I felt very honeymoony, tropical. I have on this really pretty, it kind of even matches this with that little bit of yellow, kind of. Um, this is from Shein. Today, Yara and I are going into the city because we're going to buy some luggage at um, the Away store. And since we're going to be in the city, we thought we would just like get lunch with my mom, see her for a little. So I'm just throwing on a light 
glam because I want to take a picture in this dress. I have some new makeup that I got for the honeymoon because I don't want to wear like heavy makeup. But if I want to throw on something light, um, we're going to Dominican Republic. So it's going to be hot. So I got a bunch of these little nude sticks. Uh, I've seen people use these before. And I figure it would be like a nice light makeup vibe. So we've got this blur stick. And we've got, and we're going to be packing in this vlog. I have like honeymoon stuff to show you guys. Um, then we've got this all over face color, but it's like a blushy color. And lastly, we have um, this highlighter one. But I'm going to do a quick round of like testing for the honeymoon makeup right now with you guys. And I'm going to change my hair too. I've just been walking Coco and we've just been chilling. So... This is how I'm gonna do it on the honeymoon. Like, I just wanna do hands, quick, like a light coverage, cause like, I know it's gonna come off easily. Sweat and water. Oh, but that color looks pretty good. It's neutral tan, cause my last one was a little too light. And I'm just gonna take a teeny bit more on this little blemish right here just a little more coverage and we'll do just a little bit of bronzer oh oh no 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 this is not bronzer i got i'm so stupid i bought this as like a sheer foundation to put over oh good because the color looks like almost identical to the cc cream i got that just to cover um like blemishes and redness yeah because i was like i don't think i got bronzer but i just want to like even out my skin tone and all that so tomorrow's gonna be crunch time with packing uh, but i thought i'd just take you guys along today oh this is cute it's got a brush on one end i feel like i may have used one of these before this color is in the nude i'm gonna just do a little little blush do a tiny bit on the nose a tiny bit on the forehead and a tiny bit on the lid and I'm just using the A Cosmetics Heavenly Skin brush to blend all this out. I did also pick up a waterproof brow pencil. This one's from Tarte. It's the Amazonian Clay. Um, comment below if you guys have been here since Amazonian Clay days. That was like one of my first favorite like high-end foundations. It's like the first time I like splurged on a foundation. And then we'll just take a little bit of this bubbly BB highlighter cream as well this one also has a little brush i don't know why i don't want to use the brush right now and just dab it on it's a pretty highlight it looks nice see that's like a nice really quick skin routine i love just being able to use like my hands in one brush i'm going to use just a tiny bit of this nars um soft matte concealer under the eye a little i feel like in all actuality this will take me like you know five minutes on the day-to-day -day, because you know i do want to take some honeymoon pics i probably won't wear makeup every day but you know well maybe every day at dinner i don't know i'm just going with the flow you know what i mean so that's my little honeymoon makeup vibe and then this was on tiktok apparently the kvd beauty dazzle sticks are like crazy good it's um really popular right now I got the shade uh, Hailstorm, I think, and it just goes on your lid, and apparently it does not move, and I'm like, okay, great, because for some tropical humidity, you know, this is all I can really do, and it's like the prettiest champagne-y silver, so you can put it on your eyes, and it kind of looks like you did something, even though you didn't. And I'll just bring some Laura Mercier translucent powder to set under the eye. Let's do a little bit of this. I'm literally just like testing out all this stuff. Oh, it's nice and thin. I really need to tweeze my brows before we go. Oh, my lanta. But I feel like at minimum throwing on brows and mascara just makes me feel more human and I know we'll probably be swimming like every day of course we are going to be vlogging the honeymoon so you guys will get to see so I'm excited to 
take you guys along for the journey. And I do have a waterproof mascara as well. And this is about it. I'm just gonna do something like this, a little lip gloss, and then I'll call it a day. So that's the update for right now. Just wanted to share some of these new products and kind of just test them with you. I kind of want to add just like a little more blush. It's such a pretty color. Like it's very subtle, which I like. And it blends really nicely too. It's not getting like patchy. Because you guys know I get really stressed with cream blush because sometimes it can get really... uh patchy when you put it on. All right, I thought I'd show you quickly after I finished up. I sprayed a little Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk 2 from Charlotte Tilbury and then Charlotte Tilbury Lip in Pillow Talk. Very glowy. It's mostly cream, but I'm very content with the color. Like it's not perfect, but it's definitely, I think the best it can be since I'm just red undertone. I don't want my face to be like red, red, but okay. Off we go. Say hi to the vlog. Hi vlog. Hi vlog. <laughs> hi vlog. <laughs> We're having lunch in Seaport with a watery view. Very nice. <laughs> Yarman had this umbrella fall. <laughs> what can you do? Day for me. Everyone freaked out. Oh, there's a sandbag on. <laughs> He's like, I'm fine. <laughs> like, I feel like it's got a good. Uh... Oh yeah, listen to this. Listen to that. Mm. Yum. So we just went and bought our suitcases. <laughs> and now we're walking back to the car. And the arm's just double fists and this is life after COVID in Boston. Well I'm not saying COVID's over people, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. They lifted the mask me, so it's popping. Hello guys, it's the next day. Our honeymoon is tomorrow. I am so excited. I'm like giddy. Um, so, Coco and I, want to say hi, Coco? Hi, buddy. You having a good time, Coco? Uh, I'm grabbing myself a frozen coffee. Uh, we watched the Formula One race this morning and then took Coco for a nice long walk. It is very hot. I'm gonna have to shower. I'll probably shower tonight. Does anyone else spend a lot of time trying to figure out like, uh, when to shower when they're going on vacation not shower but like wash your hair it's all about the hair washing right um so I'll probably I'm thinking I'm like probably do that tonight sleep with my hair in braids just so I have like some waves for the plane <laughs> I don't know I thought about self tanning and I'm like you're going to a tropical place where you can just get a normal tan uh, from the sun. So we haven't packed yet. We're actually, well, the reason I'm, I took Coco in the car because he loves car rides. Like we go on walks and he like runs to the car. He loves the car. Um, but we're gonna go do a Target pickup order. I just grabbed us like toothpaste. I ended up grabbing Yar this really cute linen button up shirt. It's like short sleeve. Um, we might go to Old Navy later today because he wants to get like just a couple other summery clothes. He does not have like a ton of like summer appropriate clothing and then we'll get home and start packing i feel like i've got everything pretty organized it's just a matter of like packing it so um let's uh let's get this coffee and let's get to packing i just filmed a tiktok showing some of the items i'm bringing so i've been using this like i use the tula protect and glow a lot lately but then i also got this in pr and it's a mattifying facial sunscreen and I really like it. I'm, of course, bringing the Almighty Neck Fan at this point. I need it. I live for it. It is actually life. I feel like on the airplane, this will be clutch because sometimes airplanes are super hot. I'm going to bring my Amazon little, you know, toiletry bag. I got a couple of these Copper Tones SPF 15. Um, I got this really cute sarong um, that's plus size friendly. Uh, to wrap around my waist you guys will see on instagram if you're not following me there honeymoon content is gonna be lit um, it's gonna be a lot of fun so um this is great just to throw this around your waist when you're walking to like the pool or the beach or whatever and then i got this other really cute cover-up which you guys will see on me um as well it's got like really cute oversized fit with um kind of like braiding down the side 
and then it opens up and you can like tie this. It's really, really, really pretty. Got my Amazon hat, my nippy skins, eye makeup remover because I'm going to be wearing um, waterproof mascara. I got some shampoo and conditioner, some more of those True & Co bras that I'm obsessed with. Those came in. I'm hyped toothpaste this is the charger for the neck fan okay so i have kind of been accumulating oh, honeymoon clothes <laughs> so i <laughs> have a lot of stuff here i kind of went through it already because let's be honest i'll probably wear a couple outfits a day it's really hot different things to do some moments will be more casual some won't like i've got a couple of swimsuits this one is so cute from Swimsuits for All. Uh, and the back has like crisscross opening, super cute. So I have Fashion Nova and Swimsuits for All and then a little bit of Forever 21. Got a couple of tank tops that I've had, um, I've been waiting to use from Nordstrom from Halogen um, with a built-in bra. I got one in black and white. I'm very simple, you know, most of the time I feel like my looks are gonna be pretty like for the daytime probably cute denim shorts and a nice tank top um and then nighttime i want to like kind of dress up when we go to dinner like fashion nova i haven't bought from them in a while i just kind of forgot about them uh but i followed them on instagram again and like saw some cute stuff they had and look at this maxi dress like it is absolutely to die for it's got like slits on it it's, i think this is just gonna be like just so stunning <laughs> so i'm really excited to like dress up for dinner oh, i got this cute two-tone skirt <laughs> here's a little mini haul for you oh this really gorge because of course i want to like shoot some cool outfit pics and like you know have content for you guys i got this really cool jumpsuit i don't know if it'll be too hot for a jumpsuit but is it really that different than a maxi dress probably not this maxi i have a couple really beautiful maxis from uh fashion nova this is a really cute bathing suit from swimsuits for all one piece with these little knots on there and then it has like a lot of wrap around the uh waist it's the bottoms to that bikini i got a neon bikini <laughs> this is another beautiful maxi dress like a halter maxi oh be so pretty this is another romper no nope, jumpsuit jumpsuit oh, tropical honeymoon energy honestly definitely got too many clothes will i wear all of them though probably so i'm not too mad about it um all right let's go mm -hmm. 